Thank you very much again uh, to, to be invited in this uh, wonderful Congress. We're going to talk about the preliminary results of our randomized control trial, local versus standard treatment in rectal cancer. I think uh, we all know that now when we are uh, diagnosed uh, rectal cancer with uh, uh, T, T2 uh, N0, the, uh, which the guidelines says that the uh, transabdominal resections, total mesorectalization is, is the way. So uh, what is the place in, of local excision in rectal cancer? We all know that for T2, the uh, local recurrence in only local excision is very high, is more than or 20%. If we do a local excision and chemotherapy, uh, the local recurrence is also high, so only uh, the best results comes from chemotherapy and local excision. As we have just uh, seen, and the results from uh, Abragama in, in Brazil give us uh, good results. Also in 25, in 2005 from Lethoque also give us good results, but in a, in a systematic review in 2008, only 237 experience of uh, chemotherapy, preparative and uh, local, re and, and local excision were the results. So, uh, what, what should we do in, in this T2 N0 M0? The only uh, answer is to make a uh, control randomized trial. So that is why uh, in August 20, 2010, we start a phase three multicenter perspective control, control and randomized trial to evaluate the safety and efficacy of uh, treatment of rectal cancer in T2 and superficial or T3A N0 M0 with propriotic chemotherapy and transcendent endoscopic surgery versus total mesorectalization. 12 hospitals in Spain, one of those, the clinic hospital here, uh, belongs to this study. So uh, the uh, main uh, objective has been to analyze the results of local recurrence after two years in patients treated with preoperative chemotherapy and TOTM with patients treated with conventional uh, radical surgery TME. And the secondary objectives has been to analyze the results for survival at three years to assess the results for quality of life in patients that administers one or other therapy, clinical and histological response of patients undergoing preoperative chemotherapy and subsequent uh, surgery, uh, local surgery, and the morbid mortality associated preoperative neoadjuvants.